Good morning, everyone. It is morning. It's a little bit disheveled around here. I'm hopping in the shower because guess what today is? Today is presentation day. Let's get that done. I'm ready to go. And I guess if you're new here, my name is Haley and welcome to Mom Life Vermont. I am in Iowa at the moment. I'm at a conference for work. And today I'm actually presenting in front of a couple, I don't know how many people will come, they get to decide if they wanna come, so maybe I'll be presenting to a room full of nobody. <laughs> but let's head on downstairs and we'll see how the day goes. Oh, I'll show you my outfit downstairs and I'll also tell you about the chub rub, chub rub hack that I did today and um, we'll see if it works. <laughs> presentation is set up my room is beautiful and so far I have two people in there so I know it's not gonna be an empty room but there's my presentation be excited so is life I forgot to press play and I definitely did not stand in front of the camera at all <laughs> during my presentation, but it went so well. I was probably like 15 people, 20 people in the room. I got really worried that my presentation wasn't like on target for what they were expecting, but everyone loved it. They loved it. It's so happy. So, great day. I'm not sure what the rest of the day is going to become. I think I have a presentation to go to. So, yeah. That's kind of cool, you get to experience a lot of things. Yeah, it is. Good afternoon. I feel like we haven't done that in a while. Alright, I'm just heading back to my room. I'm going to give Kenzie and my mom a call because mom said that Kenzie wanted to talk to me. And yesterday when I tried to talk to them, mom asked Kenzie if she wanted to talk to me and Kenzie was like, you talk to her by yourself. So, we didn't get to talk yesterday, so I will give her a call today. I'm gonna run up to my room because I need my badge, which I have forgotten, I love that. The day I present was the day I forgot my badge. So is my life. All right, let's see what trouble we can get into and head on upstairs. All right, everybody. So, sorry, I'm a little closer. I wanted to give you a look-see at my outfit before I took it off. Do not mind my messy hotel room. Reminds me, I gotta go talk to the front desk. They just tried to kick me out saying I was supposed to check out today. So that was really fun. But this is what I got going on today. I did have a different shirt on, but that is not what I, like in terms of like when I originally had tried stuff on, this was not the black shirt I had tried it on with. But in the end, I just, I feel like I needed spandex to kind of suck everything in with the other shirt and I didn't have that. So this is what you got. This is what I presented in. So it was a good day. It was a good presentation. I'm having fun. And I will see you guys in a minute. All right, guys. So the conference is like officially done. We just closed our last meeting. Everything else all set. I do want to kind of like show you some of the rooms that we've had the meetings in because this hotel is really, really nice. And I'm assuming since the, it's officially done that... Some of these rooms are going to be used for other things. So let me just kind of show you the rooms and show you around. And I hope you guys enjoy the little bitty tour. I will be doing a full hotel tour in tomorrow's video. So, well, in the next video posted, it'll be filmed tomorrow, but probably posted in about three days. So enjoy. I'll see you guys later. So this was like the like pre-function area. They always had coffee sitting here. There was a cooler there. You could come, you could sit. One thing I really, really, really thought was fun around here is they have this extra large um, tic tac, tic, what is it called? Connect four? No, that's not right. Yes, tic-tac-toe. Um, so, no, I was like, tic-tac, that is not right. 
because <laughs> I have this, which is very, very fun, and just kind of like some loungy areas. I think they're setting up for stuff because that was not there before. One spot that I actually really, really enjoyed, look at these fun chairs, is this place seems like it's very Instagram worthy just based on some of the things that they have on their walls and some of the things that I found just around. Like, very rarely do I go, I could take a picture in this stall in the bathroom. But these are fun. I don't know why, but I find them to be fascinating. So there's that. So this was the pre-function area. And then I did show you guys earlier, what did I show you? The room that I was in, which is actually here, right there. This was the sign. This is where I presented. Didn't look like that. They're definitely changing some stuff around in here. <laughs> I was just talking to them and I was like, I think they're getting ready for something. <laughs> oh, yep, we got a reception. <laughs> and then this was where there was a second Somebody else presented in here. I did not present in here. And then right there, there was another room that we could use, which didn't end up being used, which is totally fine. But just look, I would love to have things like this in my house. Like, look at that. This is fun. Here's another, like, a very Instagram-worthy moment, as well as that. But have your picture taken with the flashes. Then, like, the main conference and where dinner was had and where most of our presentations were is across this little hallway and on the first day I showed you this sign which is a skywalk so you basically walk across the sky and then you come up here to the main function area which is this room so we spent most of the conference in this room and it did actually connect to a dining room that's in here. And they closed off this, but we will walk around the corner and I'll show you it. So right over here, this is where the dining room was. They had the buffet set out over here. And then we had, we ate here. So that was like the conference areas, the just where we had the whole function, where things were set up. It was very, very nice. Um, but definitely check out the next video with the whole hotel tour and my room tour and all of that fun stuff. But I hope you enjoyed the last day of the conference and I'm definitely going out to the sculpture garden. Um, it depends on how long this video is at this point. It'll either be at the end of this video or in one of the upcoming videos of a nice little um, what it is, is it called? Papa John's Sculpture Park, which is where I'm going tonight. So I will see you guys later and have a fabulous day. Bye. -bye. I forgot to tell you guys. So I think earlier in the day, I was like, oh, I'm going to tell you about this, um, like fat girl chub rub hack. And I do want to let you know, yesterday I put on the internet, will natural deodorant work for a chub rub hack? And most people said, no, use cornstarch, use this, use that. Well, I only had natural deodorant, so I used it. And I have to say, I am very surprised with the results. Here at 4.30, I applied it once this morning and no chafing, it feels good. The one thing I had is, if you've ever used natural deodorants, they seem to be a little bit softer than traditional deodorants and required you to rub them in a little bit. So I went to the bathroom at one point today and I was like, what is on the toilet seat? And realized it was my natural deodorant just like chilling on the toilet seat. So that girl hack, my natural deodorant definitely worked with the chub rub. I do have to say I looked on the packaging of my natural deodorant and it says that it does reduce wetness and maybe that's why it worked a little bit better than some natural deodorants that don't have any type of antiperspirant or prevent wetness feature. So girl hack, fabulous, wonderful. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.